With the release of Godzilla and Kong, the New Empire's trailer, and of course, the subsequent toy line leaks, a lot of people are talking about this film and what to expect. With new kaiju threats, new locations in the Hollow Earth, new abilities for Godzilla and King Kong, but one of the things I haven't heard people talk about is the second villain kaiju. Now, there's not much really known about this villain kaiju other than a toy leak and a sort of cave painting that appeared in some of the leaked images for this film. And that is Titanus Shimu, which is this sort of ice-themed kaiju. Beyond this point, I'm going to issue a spoiler warning as the film isn't even out yet. But what I'm about to talk about are some major plot details in regards to this character. Um, things may change, obviously, when the film officially releases. But as of right now, I'm going to be issuing that spoiler warning. So you have been warned. It's pretty obvious at this point that Scar King is going to be the main villain of Godzilla and Kong, the new empire. But there's going to be a second villain kaiju. And that is Titanus Shimu, which is depicted, at least in the cave painting that we've seen, and the toys, as this large dragon-looking thing. It's like this wyvern. It doesn't have wings. It does have this sort of spiky shell with these icicle-like spikes coming off the top of it. Very reminiscent of Anguirus. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if it doesn't homage Anguirus directly. It's also got this long tail with this sort of thagomizer at the end, and, and there's this long dragon-like neck with this sort of beaked face and a mouth full of sharp teeth. It's also four-legged, which looks like it'll be close to the ground, but apparently Scar King wants to awaken Shimu so he can cause an ice age that would wipe out humanity, basically freeze the Earth. It has been rumored that Scar King will have some sort of mind control ability, or he'll be able to control the mind of Shimu to get Shimu to, even if it doesn't want to obey Scar King as the Alpha Kaiju, Shimu can still be controlled by Scar King against its will to do Scar King's bidding, in which case would be to freeze the entirety of Earth. Here's where I come to theory territory. Notice how I said Alpha Kaiju in reference to Scar King earlier. And that is because I believe that Scar King is the Hollow Earth's Alpha Kaiju. Like Godzilla and Kong are Alpha Kaiju, Scar King is as well. And my reason for this is we see Scar King in the Hollow Earth in what looks like a shrine that's similar to the one that Kong has now called home and where he got his awesome battle axe in Godzilla vs. Kong. It seems like Scar King is down here sort of being a dictator to these other ape-like kaiju similar to Kong, but he appears to be ruling them with an iron fist. He's even marked them as his property, which is sort of like owning slaves, I would imagine. It's also safe to assume that the Scar King probably views Kong as a threat to his rule. Scar King obviously rules over this group of ape-like kaiju with an iron fist and probably using fear tactics. He's even marked them, like I said before, so we could probably say that he views Kong as a threat and probably wants to get rid of Kong as soon as possible. Now, where does Shimu come into all of this? Well, we know that Shimu is asleep during much of the film, and that Kong and Godzilla are going to team up, they're going to go to the Hollow Earth, and they're going to try to stop Scar King from awakening Shimu. Shimu is awakened at the end of the movie, but after Scar King is killed. 
So it looks like Scar King was able to wake up Shimu, but it doesn't seem like Scar King has control over Shimu's mind because, well, he's dead. Looking at Shimu's design currently, I think it looks really cool and badass. I love that it looks like a blend between two of my favorite kaiju, Anguirus with the obvious tail that's like a flail at the end and the spikes on the back, but also Manda with that dragon-like appearance. Looks really cool. I love it. I can't wait to see what this kaiju does in the actual movie because right now this is just rumors. The mind control of Scar King, the freaking freezing of the earth, that's all literally rumors. But it sounds like it's really fleshed out, so I'm more inclined to believe that this is actually going to be a part of the movie. But it'd be really cool to see what else this kaiju might get up to during the film. With that being said, hope you guys enjoyed. Do take care. Have a great night. And I'll see you in the next video.